Welcome to Touch Technology Review. Today, we're gonna to be checking out the Thrommax M Drill Ghost USB-C microphone incorporating RGB lighting and lighting effects. This is a beautiful looking microphone. The industrial design throughout is stunning and the RGB lighting, I think, offers a really cool aesthetic. The Thrommax M Drill Ghost includes 96 kilohertz recording that allows you to capture true 96 kilohertz 24-bit digital recording on your desktop. The M Drill Ghost also incorporates the unique Vertigain technology, which increases recording and streaming quality by 10% through the sound enhancing acoustic chamber. In terms of compatibility, the M Drill Ghost is compatible with Mac, PC, iPhones, Android phones, and the PS5. I've got it in front of me now, and I've connected it to my MacBook Air to record this video. And as you can hear, it sounds incredible. It has four recording patterns, including cardioid, stereo, omnidirectional, and bidirectional. I'm using the cardioid pattern, which favors the input of audio from the front of the microphone and rejects audio from the side and the back. So this is ideal for those of you podcasting and streaming where you wanna minimize background noise. Now, in terms of the aesthetic of the microphone, I've always loved the Thrommax products. I originally reviewed the M Drill One about a year ago, and I've been using it ever since as my USB-C microphone for videos on this channel and podcasts and so on. I've always loved the industrial design of that microphone, and this is very similar to the original. It's slightly larger, a little bit thicker, and it also incorporates the RGB lighting throughout the whole microphone. On the original, there was RGB lighting on the base, and on this new Ghost microphone, you have the RGB lighting in this midsection, which is amazing. You can tap to change the color of the RGB. There's a button on the base of the microphone, and as you can see, I'm changing it through all the color ranges, so you can find one that best suits your aesthetic. You can turn the LED lighting off if you prefer a more subtle look for particular productions, but I don't see why you would as it looks so good with the LED lights turned on. There's a smart LED indicator strip on the front that shows you your microphone and headphone levels. And there are two touch buttons on this strip, one at the top that allows you to mute the microphone temporarily and turn it back on. And there's also another touch button at the base which allows you to switch between the different recording patterns. At the base of the microphone, there's an RGB ring of light, which also looks amazing. There's also a 3.5 input jack for monitoring with headphones, and this provides zero latency, which is really important when you're monitoring your audio. If you've ever tried to monitor audio when plugging the headphones into the computer itself on certain applications, you'll notice there's quite often a small amount of lag or delay in the audio, which can be really annoying. So by monitoring directly through the microphone itself, you get zero latency and it sounds perfect. There's also the USB-C connection for inserting the USB-C cable or the USB-C to USB-A cable, both of which are provided in the box. Speaking of which, let's take a look at what you get inside the box. First of all, there is a hard shell protective case that will protect your microphone if you're traveling with it. There are the two cables, the instruction manual, and some Thrommax stickers. There's also a quiet zone do not disturb door hanger, which is great for alerting your colleagues in the office or household members that you're recording. And then there's the microphone unit itself on the stand. And there's also an additional attachment for using this microphone with the optional Thrommax boom arms. I've actually reviewed both of these on the channel and I'll leave a link to both the Thrommax boom arm and the S6 twist boom arm, which are great options for those of you podcasting and streaming as it provides more flexibility in terms of where you can position the microphone. Thanks for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed this video on the Thrommax M Drill Ghost. As a shout out and acknowledgement, I'd like to thank Thrommax for sending me this microphone for this review. I hope you enjoyed watching the video as much as I enjoyed making it. And no doubt, this will now become my new USB microphone of choice. If you have any comments or questions, drop them in the comments box below. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.